Hello, I'm Illuminate McCauley. Here's a Channel Television Evening News Recap for March the 1st, 2020. The government of Ogun State has received some basic health care items from the Nigerian Center for Disease Control to be distributed to its emergency operating centers across the 20 local government areas. This follows an increase of the number of contacts identified to have had contact with the Italian citizen in Ewekoro to 39 from 28 earlier announced by the Ogun State government. Also in health, the Lagos State Governor Babajide Samolu visited the Emergency Operations Center in Yaba for an on-the-spot assessment of the facility. The Governor and his deputy Abafemi Hamzat, dressed in personal protective gear, went around the center, after which they gave the assurance that the state government will give full support to the ongoing operation at the center. He also enjoined the media to support and ensure that effective awareness is created. Socioeconomic Rights and Accountability Projects, the RAP has sent an open letter to the Senate President, Dr. Ahmed Lawan, urging him to use his leadership position to ensure that the bill that will allow repentant Boko Haram terrorists opportunities to access public funds to enjoy foreign education is immediately dropped. In a statement on Sunday, Sarap also asked the Senate President to sponsor bills that will ensure access to justice and reparation for the victims of Boko Haram terrorist group. On the international scene, the first fatality from the coronavirus has been confirmed in the United States as President Donald Trump on Saturday urged Americans not to panic. Health officials said the man who died in Washington state was one of a handful with no known contact to global hot zones to have contracted the virus, indicating that the pathogen was not likely spreading in communities. And in sports, dethroned world heavyweight champion Deontay Wilder has exercised his rematch clause and will fight Tyson Fury a third time, according to media reports on Saturday. And that's the evening news recap. Don't forget to join us later for the morning news update. I'm Alumide McCauley. Thank you for watching.